Online here, your ultimate guide to astrology and planetary placement. As you all know, in this channel, we dive deep into celestial bodies and results. If you're curious about how the stars align to shape your destiny, you've come to the right place. Join our Patreon community, Moon Nine Care for exclusive content and personalized astrological guidance. Connect with us on Instagram at the rate Moon Nine Care, where we share daily insights and updates. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for regular videos about astrology. Hari Krishna. As I am very late to post the results of Rahu transit in Aries. Also, one of my subscribers, Soumya, wanted me to post the results of Rahu transit in Aries results. Okay, so the Rahu is transited and moved into Aries on seventeenth March two thousand twenty-two, and will remain there till twenty-ninth November two thousand twenty-three. Okay, I follow mean nodes. Okay. That's why the transit is ending on twenty ninth November. Usually on Google you'll see it is going to end on thirtieth October. But I follow mean nodes. Okay, that's why it will stay here till November. Okay, so Rahu represents illusion, foreign lands, foreign things, drugs, medicines, any type of intoxication, fame, wealth, success, obsession, past life, leftover karma. Movies, television, online world, cheating, imagined fears, unusual things, unique things, creativity, rule breaker. Okay, Rahu also blows things out of proportions. Okay, during transit, Rahu is basically that obsessive energy which makes us gravitate towards the things related to the house or sign. Okay, and Aries is the first sign of the zodiac belt, so it represents the things energy of the first house. Okay, like self, personality. Besides that, Aries is a sign of individuality, aggression, actions, competitive ability. Okay, so Rahu in Aries will be through the sign Rahu converts himself as the Lord of the sign. Okay, it is sitting in Aries, so it will act as a Mars. Okay, please see the results of the transit from Ascendant and Moon sign both. Predictions from Ascendant sign will show what can actually happen. and predictions from moon sign will show what our mind desires and how mind will react to such events okay this results are from 17th march 2022 to 29th november 2023 okay for the gemini people rahu will move into the 11th house of gains entrepreneurship serving humanity it shows that you can have good gains during this time but again the best gains can be through the business setup you can have the promotion in job you can be very social in your networking circles but other people can see you as an aggressive person also at the same time saving money can be tough as rahu remains a malefic planet you can have relocation you can have some issues with your elder siblings your higher education and knowledge can bring gains okay you should share your knowledge and higher education with other people also entrepreneurship social networking circle or elder siblings can be the source of the wealth okay you can be a major you can face a major instability with your mother also okay that's all guys if you guys need any personal readings you guys can message me directly on instagram hari krishna hari bol as we can see that focus of this transit will be on actions and being active try to be active but not impulsive okay